We move on now to a controversial case out of Florida, where a seven-year-old boy was taken from school in handcuffs after attacking a teacher. The police insist the boy was violent. His parents say they went too far. ABC's Victor Akendo brings the story from that school in Miami. Good morning, Victor. Good morning, George. Classes are getting underway at that school right here behind me. But this boy's father says he's not sure if he ever wants to send his son back here. This alarming video of a seven-year-old boy handcuffed outside of his Miami school, raising serious questions this morning. Did police go too far? I'm thinking not to take my kids back to the school. I'm afraid for my kids' safety. Rolando Fuentes saw his son cuffed and led away. No pasa nada, mi amor, sabe? The boy's mother right there as well, recording everything on her phone, reassuring him everything would be okay. Thursday, police say the seven-year-old attacked one of his school teachers at the Coral Way K-8 Center after being told not to play with his food. His parents were called to the school and met with the principal. Shortly after, the boy was in police custody. My kid has an honor roll. My kid is super good in the school, and he was doing so well. Yeah, everybody was excited about it. You know, the teachers, everybody. And out of sudden, happened this. The student was taken to the hospital for an evaluation and was released. In a statement, police said this action was warranted to prevent his erratic and violent behavior from bringing further harm to others or himself. This boy's father says that a similar incident happened with his son last year. He saw a physician after that who said that there's nothing wrong with the boy who's now been suspended for 10 days. George. Okay, Victor, thanks very much.